fake. I'm a fake player back there. You're a thought. I disagree. Good. I had to make sure you would resist some things. <laughs> so we've established you're not a thought, okay. and you're not a fake player either. Okay. Good. Also, we're I working play, our I way. I play a loser list. Nice. Oh. Not nice. I feel awful. I I thought uh, he just suited now, but we're playing uh, three stock and. Like a good commentator, I will not make a joke about good game, haha, -ha, game one's X, over. Big X, bigger D. You know? Yeah, huge. Totally original, XD, never yeah. been made before joke. Yeah, well, we might as well just like slam in nice back air, and uh, it's not over yet because this player, if anyone could do it, could come back. Those are my favorite commentary tropes. I think I'm furious. Never count. Yeah, two stacks is not a lead. Well, That's hey, like a that wrong game. I actually, I'm so happy I watched IAB and I get that one, open. But regardless, hey. okay. back to the match. So <laughs> we are that. starting out. I really like that Zay's going to for this matchup. It really worries me. Uh, I know Fox can do it. Um, but the, the thing at high level is we have to stop looking at, you know, can this character do it and versus can this character do it consistently? And if your character can do it but can't win consistently at a top level, uh, you know, it's that's when you consider moving into different matchups. Ooh, nice down air from Led. I really like that. Uh, Ooh, I like that situation a lot because if Zay did anything other than get away, he would have lost the stock immediately. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think we put on some pressure. A uh, small lead from Lima, but comparatively, it's a very large lead considering how early Bayonetta can kill and how long it will take for Sheik to build up the damage enough to get that kill. Yeah. Um, the one thing I really like about Sheik in this matchup is Sheik's actually got a pretty good disadvantage state versus Bayonetta. Uh, she can be on the ledge or just kind of off the stage, and Sheik can kind of maneuver her way around uh, the stage in a way that Bayonetta has to really lay out some thick traps. Um, I feel like Sheik's frame down in this matchup is so good. Because Bayonetta's frame down, other than like, you know, her upbeat, ooh, my stop, is a little lackluster, you know, compared to a lot of the things that Sheik can do. Her job is amazing, her nair, her fair, and her best tool is her upbeat, which is slightly metal. I wish. So, uh, right there, um, Bayonetta had to side B. Uh, I think that was a pretty important opportunity that Zay should have looked at, and if he knew that the side B had to come, if you avoid it, like maybe like crawl under it, you get a free punish from that. I think he was thinking maybe Lima would hit the ledge. Mm -hmm. um, but, oh, Smashville. No. Not quite, not quite. Yeah, it was, it was on its way back. Regardless, Zay with a pretty solid lead, honestly. Yeah, he has to be really careful. Don't throw it away here. That was not the best EI, but Lima's too low for something. Good. That was really good. Oh, oh he, yeah, he was looking for it, but Lima knew better. He just played Carnal left you know. There. Ooh. I mean, he won't die. Unless I, he's... I, I don't, don't say that when Lima's playing, please. <laughs> oh, that's... <laughs> okay, <laughs> he got away from that last one. He won't there. die, see? I thought it was good. He okay. just took 70%. It, 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 no, <laughs> no biggie. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's it. Oh, you the yes. Is that going to be it? That's wow. Wow, she's a tall girl. She's a very tall girl. Zay, SRC Zay taking game one over. Interesting. I, yeah, I bet Bayonetta was like looking at her heels after that match. Like, Why am I wearing heels? I'm so tall <laughs> anyways. Like, that just got me killed. Because if she didn't wear heels, she couldn't have guns on her feet, right? I can still. Yeah. I can accept that as an answer to wear heels, so you can tie guns to your feet. They're not really tied. What are, they're just attached yeah, to yeah, the yeah. shoe. They're part of the shoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, they're, that's not true, you know. But whatever. What back, are they? Back to the match. Are they, like, the belted on hers? It's complicated. It's complicated? Oh, my God. This seems like a, like a Facebook relationship. <laughs> it is. Oh, anyways. Well, I don't imagine anyone could tie Bayonetta down. Not even the guns tied to it. Anyways. <laughs> okay. Back for your objective with the best commentator. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Um, so, I, I do like the counter pick here. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's a either band five platforms or a Lilat. Those are the general bands versus, uh, versus Bayo, yeah. Uh, Zay's DI isn't too bad. He has not just got strung off the top. 
I don't think that was true. That was true. It was true? Yeah. Uh, after a while, uh, Sheik's throws into Bouncing Fish are not true, and it all becomes reactable. Oh, you will. It's very close. Yeah, you always have to be careful when, like, Bayonetta's, like, sauntering over by the ledge. She'll just, like, walk off and then side me back into the stage. And there we see exactly what I was talking about with, uh, Ooh, the... Yeah. It, he good, Lima had good reaction time to get over in that. I like it. Oh, you gotta be careful with these falling airs. Ben, uh, or Lima did a great job punishing Zay for just kind of, like, marrying blind lanes and everything. This jump. Ooh, but him following anyway. Lima might be on his winner. He's on his winner's back of right now. Ooh. Big tasty. Oh my god. Big, big tasty. This would be a huge upside and a great win for Zay. Okay, yeah, so Lima is literally just back airing in place. You don't have to move forward. You can just needle for landing. Um, but that's okay. It, it's, uh, it comes a time where you like have a lead on a player and you're just like, you know, I really want to push this lead. I want to get in there. I've been winning these neutral exchanges for the most part. Um, ooh, that makes, yeah, that makes me stress. <laughs> I agree. Good SCI. Yeah, yeah, he could have killed him earlier. We have a Fox player's SCI. <laughs> He knows how to do it. Ooh, you saw that? Yeah. Here's yeah, SES from Zoom. This, uh, this makes me feel like slightly like a tough smash. That's a, yeah, 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 I forgot. You gotta tech that down smash. I forgot how fresh the witch that was. It's kind of weird that the bayonet is doing that. Yeah, I agree. Like, I don't wait until someone just, like, techs. Because, uh... Unless they recognize which way they're teching. I don't know. I mean, they could still get the great follow-up if they just kind of follow the... They could probably react to where the tech is. Maybe that's why they do it. I think Town is fine. I'm okay with Town. It's definitely not the worst. It's better than... Uh, Lila or Triplats, I would not 100% be okay with. Like, I'm pretty sure she could function fine on Battlefield. It would just be a really long game. And you can't go back as much. But in fact, uh, when Bayonetta is sprinkling out all these delicious little gun pellet things, um, if you want to move around, you got to crawl. I definitely recommend doing it. You make your body smaller, you take less damage. Nice 30-ish percent. Good. Punish. Not letting Bayonetta get over There we go. Oh my god. Zay is doing phenomenal right now. Yeah, this is where it's going to be important not to run into with those nares to get much time. Spring of power shield into... Ooh, it's very close to being a stop. Good mix-up on his uh, SCI. He, he was going down for that entire combo, and then he went up at the very, very end, and it threw him off. Amazing Tomahawk SCI. These punishes are really on point. I'm really impressed by this sheet. The upside is amazing. Not the best air dodge, but he isn't bad for it. Oh, he's a fox player missing some techs. That was such a hard tech to be fair. Wow, that's, uh, that's going to be back into the game. Dead even king. Now Lima has something to say about it. Lima is very known. Oh no. He's got bouncing fish. Man. I didn't know who was going to die, but I felt like one of them was going to die. <laughs> really, really good. Zay recognizing that he got two frames, and he did get a double jump back. Get back, but, uh, yeah, oh, he jumped right back into it, but he's out. Oh, he's out. Oh, the balloon helped him out there. Yeah, I, I saw like the weird phantom hits. He had more time to go. Though. Oh, this is the part where Lima just uh... yeah to keep his composure. Lima, if he gets back to stage, Lima's just gonna start spamming back airs. Definitely. Uh, yep. Yeah. 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 So Lima, Lima does that a lot. As soon as you get to hyper percent this just, just back air in place. It's really safe. Uh, if you've got a projectile, that is when you need to whip that out. Punish him. Just don't let him do that. Whatever you do, don't roll in. Um, I agree. But that was a really good showing. I was impressed by Zay Sheik. Uh, Zay Sheik is looking really good.